the only reason why I'm talking about this shit is because motherfuckers keep bringing this shit to my attention about the Seti Nash shit and all that type of shit. They said he was blood. They say he's from 60s and, you know, and all this type of shit. But look at here, man. All I know is we from the ne same neighborhood, same block, Strawberry Manor, 3200 Western. That's all I know. All that other shit, that's on him. I don't know nothing about that shit. I ain't from L.A. I don't really be in L.A. or none of that shit. But the fact of the matter is the nigga never was a blood. Even though my neighborhood is bloods, but it's some crips that's, you know, in the neighborhood and shit. But that's a whole nother story. But he met a cripping anthem 10 years ago that got 1.2 million views. The nigga been a crip for a long time, as long as I know him. But all this, like, 60s and all that shit, that's something he can explain himself because that don't have nothing to do with my hood or how that came about with him. But as far as I know of Seti Nash, he always did solid shit. Like, he got a solid name in the hood. You know, certain people feel some type of way about his channel or whatever. But it's the same shit with my shit. And... His shit took off, you know, his shit up there. So, you know, motherfuckers always trying to discredit and, you know, trying to figure out certain things about an individual, said he Nash himself. But the nigga be having connects. The nigga then took, then put niggas in studios that niggas didn't know about throughout SAC and other places. And he know a lot of people. The nigga be on the road, obviously, doing whatever he do. And he be in different places, so he do know a lot of people. But as far as, like, the Kings of Crips shit, that's on him, too. I don't know nothing about none of that shit because I'm a Damu myself. So that's not none of my business. None of the Crip Nation or nothing have nothing to do with me or, like, pretty much my hood as far as, like, the Damu car in my hood, period. But that's as simple as that, man. All of the 60s and people keep asking me questions and hit me in my inbox and saying he false flagging and all that shit. He been a crip for forever, right? Forever. forever. The nigga been a crip forever, man. So, as far as him in the 60s and all that shit, that's on him. I don't know. So, it is what it is, man. Still was.